Lynx. Manufacturer, Augusta Westland. Type, light utility helicopter. Power plant, two Rolls-Royce Gem 41-1 turbo shafts. Principal armament, two 20mm cannons, two 70mm rocket launchers, and eight tow missiles. Carrying capacity, 10 troops, or 2,000 pounds cargo. Maximum cruising speed, 152 miles per hour. Westland's Lynx helicopter first entered service with the British Army in the early 70s. In the years that have followed, it has proven itself to be a fearsome warrior, capable of adapting to and mastering a whole range of missions. The Lynx is a great helicopter. Basically, it's the uh, British version of the, the UH-1 and the Blackhawk. It does most of their heavy lifting. Uh, it has been adapted to uh, troop transport uh, and as submarine operations. You can arm a Lynx and use it as an anti-tank system. You can throw soldiers in the back and use it as uh, an, uh, an air assault delivery vehicle. So it's a, it's a very useful airframe. The Lynx's cutting-edge, semi-rigid titanium rotor head makes it superbly maneuverable and very fast. In 1986, a stripped-down Lynx broke the record for the fastest speed ever achieved by a chopper, recording 249 miles per hour. It's a sports car. You turn a bank, you're, you're right there quickly. Feels like you're connected. You are absolutely a part of that aircraft when you're flying it. The Lynx has probably been most successful in its naval variant. With its folding tail boom and deck capture harpoon system, it can take everything Mother Nature can throw at it and spit it right back. The Lynx is a very stable airframe. It has a reputation of being a stable aircraft in uh, adverse conditions, crosswind situations. Uh, therefore, it's ideally suited for operations in the, the North Atlantic and the North Sea. It can also churn up the water with Stingray homing torpedoes, twin depth charges, or four Sea Skua anti-ship missiles. During the Falklands War, it attacked and deterred Argentina's submarine fleet. And in 1991, it again ruled the waves, sending Saddam Hussein's navy to the seabed. In the 21st century, the Lynx has been significantly upgraded. Hellfire missiles can be added to its payload, and newer engines have increased its carrying capacity by 20%. This is an aircraft that can take it. This is an aircraft that I could take out there, be successful, accomplish the mission, and it's going to bring me back home. The Lynx's ability to multitask gives it high versatility. With new versions in the pipeline, service length is also good. But compared to other helicopters in this list, the Lynx is low in innovation and has average survivability, making this the eighth best chopper in our top ten. <laughs>